Hello Penelope. Oh, definitely get right on that. And hello to anyone else who may be here. Uh, I decided to play... What's this game again? Stardew Valley? That's right. Uh, I have played before. But that was many, many years ago. Uh, to the point that I don't really remember. Aaron, hello! I'm doing well. Maybe I should have watched the, uh, the tutorial setup, because I don't remember how to do anything in this game. It's fine. It's fine. Howdy to yourself. Alright, well. I'm just gonna do what I do best. Menial labor. I think I just went with the normal setup. Oh wait, what is it? There's a button that just swings in whichever direction you're going. Ah, that's fine. I'll just use the mouse cursor. I just remember the controls in this game being exceptionally finicky. No, put that down. Oh, that's why I was having issues. Right. Yes, uh, this, this game will allow you to see a microcosm of how I think. So that'll be interesting. The way I plan things out. And the, the quick answer for how I plan things out is I typically don't. And I just go with things as they present themselves to me. I'm pretty sure I never actually made too large of a farm, even when I played this game before for the first time. I wonder if there's been any new additions to this game since I played it last. That would have been around the time the game launched, so... There's always a chance that this game has just remained stagnant. I know there's a multiplayer feature. I never really looked into that at all. I never had anyone to play with. I didn't know anyone else who owned this game. This is roughly around the area that I really need for the entirety of my farming experience in this game. Alright. Well, let's just get a patch set up then. Two, three, four. Making sure everything is placed is such a pain. Oh, and I just don't have quite enough seeds to actually make 3x3 three three patches, do I? So I play this game in 3x3 three three patches. Um, oh, I hate this. I can just get rid of those. Um, I suppose that doesn't really matter too much right now. I can just go an extra two layers deep. But I'm, I'm very much a function over form type of person. The reason to go three by three is that you can just stand in the center and get a full square and then move down and repeat process. It's Blindingly easy. Wow. Yes. That's actually the, uh, the reason that I was half an hour late to stream, is that Ina was streaming, and I didn't want to miss it. Uh, 
finishing up a watch along of Back to the Future. What are my, what are my mini quests? Well, that takes time. And I need to talk to 50 people or whatever it was. 24? Lower number than that. Hmm. Well, I was actually able to represent myself surprisingly well in this game. I was quite surprised by that. Actually, can I just go check in at the general store? I'm just going to be a hermit farmer. That's all I know. Nope, I thought there was a notice board there as well. Oh, okay, maybe I'm just mistaken. I don't remember. Okay, I should definitely get beans early. Since those are, um, what is it? It's just efficient to have them as long as possible. So let's just say, what, five? Since I don't have too much money right now. Oh, and I remember potatoes are actually pretty good as well. Let's just sell those for pennies on the dollar. I guess I'll just grab my, the maximum amount of those I can as well. Is that, mm. All right. Actually, is the uh, the game audio too loud? Because I don't think I don't think there's like sliders for it. It's either on or off. Oh no, there is. It was it was just exceptionally loud when I launched the game for the first time. The levels look relatively balanced on my end. So. It's going to have to be a call that I receive from outside. Right. One, two, three. Oh, this is actually the perfect number. Maintain some degree of symmetry. about to die. Hmm. Alright. 14? How much does one water take? Two. Alright. Oh no, I'm not gonna be able to water all of my beans. Or else I will literally collapse out of exhaustion. I can get two of them. If only I'd cut up one less stump. Or bought one less potato, I could actually go get some food. Actually, you know what? I think I can actually just go and see if I can find some dandelions to eat. Uh, but I can't leave through that exit. Just scavenging for food. I don't know, those don't give any energy. I swear there's just plants you can pick up off the ground that'll give you a little bit of oomph. I was, I was actually incredibly inefficient my first time playing through this. Because I did not... I did not consume any food back in the first time I played this, so I, uh... I just absolutely did not have the maximum amount of efficiency that I could have per day. It just wasn't something that ever occurred to me, really. The fact that eating food gives energy. I always just thought that it's more efficient to sell your food for money rather than eat it for energy so that you could do more in a single day. But I think there's probably some logic to, uh, you know, eating some of your food, or even cooking some of your food. Here we go, this has got to give me energy, right? Oh, that's a whopping 40 energy off of that one leaf. 
13 off of a horseradish. Hmm. And I can actually go back in through this way, because now I can cut things down. Right. How do I eat you? Consume. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that does. Oh, there we go. I guess I just didn't try right-clicking. I swear I did. Oh. I guess you have to right-click twice. That's fine. My goodness. Okay. Oh. I don't have to let those poor beans wither. And more specifically, uh, they aren't going to grow out of line of each other now, so I don't have to, uh, be constantly irritated by that. I think that you can't place a chest there. It's just a small hole. Yeah, I didn't want to risk it was the main thing. I couldn't remember if it used power or not, but... If it did use power, uh, then it would have. I would have, uh, you know, lost my ability to do half of the things that I needed to do the following day. Uh, I suppose I'll just go and talk to the townsfolk now. I'd like to get a fishing rod. I spent most of my time in my first run through this game fishing. Pierre's still open. Oh, Pierre is still here. Hello, Pierre. It's Brista Barley on the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop's the place to go. I'll also buy produce for you from a good price. Sure you will, Pierre. Oh, right. It took me absolutely forever to buy the backpack upgrade. Um, because I just didn't remember where you got it from. It's got a big for sale sign on it, so I have no idea how I missed that. Um, but a lot of my Spelunking expeditions got caught got cut incredibly short because I you know, just didn't realize that I could have more than a single bar full of inventory space. It's a bit late. I don't know if the fisherman's gonna be out. Yeah. That was a bit of a reach. So I'll just pick up beach trash then. Sell it later. Oh yeah, I never, like, talked to the guy that lived in this shack. It's probably the NPC that I interacted with the least. should remember to carry my, um, what's it called? The one that digs. It's not a shovel. The one that lets me dig up worms for treasure. I've honestly just forgotten what it's called. Can I just sell this? Probably. Hello, T-Ranger. Right, the hoe. I need to carry that around so that I can dig up worms. That is unfortunate. My sleep schedule is blissfully intact, although I'm definitely getting to sleep a bit later than I should. Not today. Maybe. I haven't gone to sleep yet today, so who knows how late it'll be. I'm doing well. Not, not too much to complain about. 
I'm just playing this game because I didn't know what else to do. Ah, oh, okay, Willy with his fishing rod. I had, uh, I had an idea while I was working today, and I wanted to create some sort of questionnaire, but I'm not sure if or when I will actually go through with that. Just a little idea gathering that I wanted to do. Because despite the, uh, the hobby that I've taken up, I'm very bad at actually interpreting what people are interested in. Let's go grab more seeds. Let's go. 4 or 5 p.m., okay. That's fine, I can get in a little bit of farming before then. Where were the other items in the shop? I swear there were more. At least one. Oh, okay. Can I only look at notices when this is up? Uh, give me six days, Lewis. Oh. The curse of the farmer. I'm awake too early. Well, maybe I can go shopping now. Or not shopping, huh? That's what I was trying to do. Fishing. That's the one. Oh, oh, I've just teleported here. Um, I think I caught most of the uh, seasonal fish uh, back when I played this the first time. Hi there, son. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet ya. Uh, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out in the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, have my junk. It's important to me that the artificial stays alive. And then, hey, maybe we'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Arr, don't count on it, matey. Actually, count on it. I tend to do a lot of fishing in this game. There's good water here in the valley, all kinds of fish. My pirate accent's atrocious. My shop's back open now. Come by if you need supplies. Also, buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. That's <laughs> what my old pappy used to say, anyways. I'm sure he did. Uh, if I remember correctly, the starting fishing rod is almost no fun to use. Anything I want to talk about? How much to do while fishing is there, huh? Have I been doing anything interesting recently? Not really. Just been feeling kind of tired recently. Nothing important, really. Just lacking in energy. That's mainly why I haven't been streaming so much. Hopefully I'll be over it by now. I've also been pretty worried about the, um... What is it? The... Oh, whoops. The, uh... What is it? The bot raids. I just didn't want to deal with that, really, so I sort of shied away from streaming in the immediate time around when it was happening. But now it seems to have died down, so I don't... Oh, that's... Talking is distracting me. All I'm getting is seaweed. Which mercifully can be eaten. Oh. I just clicked the wrong button that time.
Alright, I was only going to do this, uh, until the general store opened up. Oh, Pierre's a trooper. He works from 9, nine to 9, 12-hour shift. Good job. Fish is giving me a hard time. How much is the next fishing rod? No, that's not what I meant to do. Um. Okay, when can I get the next one? When does it unlock? Because I'm I am using a bamboo rod, right? Yeah. I have to wait. Kind of irritating. Oh. oh. Take your fish. When I get back to my farming. Oh! This is why I've got my hoe with me. Found a lost book. Library's collection's expanded. Good for the library. Book's in remarkable condition for having been buried in the sand. my um, schedule or everything like that needs a bit of a revamp. It feels like I've been stagnant for a bit too long. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I've ever been or bought anything from Jojo Mart just never crossed my mind to go over there. Oh, that's why I was going slowly. Oops. Right, call a flower, that was the other thing. Oh my, there's actually a whole bunch of things. Are any of these... I don't know what's, like, worth cultivating. I don't remember like, any of this stuff. Here. Oh, you can sell a daffodil for 30 bucks? What is the economy in this town? Let's just grow a bunch of tulips. Why not? Probably don't sell for that much. It's cheap and I can get a 9 by 9 or a 3 by 3 patch of 9. Uh, anything else that I could possibly want? Oh, right. Saplings. Alright. Maybe I'll remember to get one of those. It took me ages before I actually got any trees in my, uh, garden last time I played this as well. I'm not a very smart investor, I'm afraid. Spend extra effort in digging that spot up. I have to get the pickaxe now. My life's in shambles. Oh, and I put the watering can away. I just can't win. Keep the seaweed around. Probably just gonna go fishing after this. Hello, Pax. It's going fine, going fine. Oh. Chest was thirsty. Just needed a little bit of water. I'm remembering correctly, all I can get out of this pond is junk, like newspapers.
I didn't actually have a plan on how far or what I was going to do in this stream. Not a big fan of. So from the, the this is supposed to be like a dress shirt, but from the side it looks like a skull with a laser eye, which is amusing but not the intended look. Recently, I've been wondering about my, um, what is it? Oh, my long-running game slot. I worry that it's mm, potentially alienating, because I know that when I tend to watch people stream, I don't like to come in at the middle of a game, but the problem is that, you know, long-running RPGs are my favorite games to play. So I feel kind of stuck in that respect. And it feels like, um, like that sort of stream is almost best suited to the, um, the Endurance or Marathon stream formats that I was doing. But that's also pretty exclusionary because, you know, I can't do those all the time. And also, there's not too many people that can stick around for the entire duration of that sort of thing, so... It's not something that I'd be well equipped to do on a frequent basis. And I actually really like Endurance Streams, I discovered. But that's probably to be expected since I like playing games. It's almost like those two things go hand in hand. Uh, at least give me something I can eat. Driftwood's inedible. Oh, I thought I actually missed that one. Cut in half. Just disconnected. But as I was saying, uh, the only real excuse I can think to uh, have any sort of celebratory or endurance stream is my one year anniversary that's coming around a month after or next. It's pretty late in the month, too. In November, that is. Just in case anyone forgot what the month after next was. Thank you for resting directly atop that chest. Oh, well, wonderful. Something I can't even use yet. Alright, I was really relying on that music. Why'd you stop playing? Now all we have is awkward silence and bird chirps. That's unfortunate. Oh, I didn't even notice I'd caught a gold star. There we go. Oh, throw in the throw in the direction I'm I'm clicking. I think the that's a feature that I'm not particularly thrilled about by this game is the fact that. Sometimes your character doesn't know whether or not to perform an action in the direction that you you are currently looking in, or in the direction that you are clicking in. Because 
it seems a lot more often than not, they'll just throw wherever. Year one. I've I've just started this game. Um, you know, half an hour ago. Oh, if you're talking about like year in game or years streaming, because it's it's zero years streaming for me. I'm approaching my one year anniversary. But this is also year one in game, or year zero. Technically year zero, but I, I think in world it's called year one. Because it is my first year here. Specific nomenclature evades me. Do I just sell all of the fish? I think so. I can catch another gold one later. Yeah. I can't even use that yet, right? I don't have a good enough fishing rod. I'll just go in the chest. I'll need it later, obviously. Not right now. Hurrah. Well, that LG sold for a surprising amount. Oh, it's raining. I don't have to water my crops. Oh, right. Scarecrows. Can I craft those yet? No? How do you do that? Do I need to up my crafting level? I don't know how to do that. just need to improve my crafting skill, which probably just means I need to craft things. Let's just make some cobblestone path. Is that gonna level me up at all? I already built an entire fence. No, no, this is my second time playing. I'm familiar with the general structure of the game, but I'm not terribly good at it. There we go. So, a facsimile of effort was made. Anything else to do? Alright, oh, what is it? Wait, is crafting not a skill? I could have sworn. Oh, well. I suppose I was mistaken on that front. If I, if I leave this, the bird's not going to come back, right? It's only when you wake up that that happens, right? Do I have to be constantly paranoid that I'm going to lose crops again? Because fortunately it was, it was in a very symmetrical place. Which I don't mind terribly much, it's just moderately annoying that I lost. Actually, I didn't even pay for those, those are just parsnips. Or parsley? Parsnips? Parsnips. Par something. I'm just constantly worried that I'm gonna run out of stuff. Might as well refill my watering can now. Since I don't need to expend actually wait. Okay, that doesn't even take energy. I thought it did. I was mistaken once more. No. 
feel like I'm missing something. There has to be a way to learn how to how to craft a scarecrow. That seems pretty vital. Paramount, in fact. Can I just buy one? Oh, right. I'm, I'm sure it does. All I remember at him about him is that he is unfriendly. Oh, raining makes it easier to fish, doesn't it? Can I just buy a scarecrow from the Jojo Mart? Scarecrow. No. Okay. Nothing else. This has to have only been like, what, maybe the fourth time I've ever walked inside the Jojo Mart. Let's see, how far did I make it my first time playing this game? Probably around... I made it to at least year three because I got the, you know, the ending of the game. Um... Why would I do that? But other than that, I don't actually remember too much. Can I learn how to make a scarecrow here? Book by Marnie. Animals are very sensitive. Like to be pet every day and prefer to eat grass outdoors than dry hay. Don't like being outside in the rain, though. Happy animals produce higher quality products. Thanks for the info. Please let me read the other book. All right, fertilizer exists. Fruit trees, yep, I remember those. Tell me how to make a scarecrow. I'm, I'm just living in constant paranoia. Something's eating my crops right now. This is good. You didn't tell me how to make a scarecrow though, so I don't care. I was actually rather surprised that I was able to get green skin in this game. Didn't seem like something that would uh, be a priority. Hello, teach me how to make a scarecrow. It's fine, I'm in your house, so I'm barely a stranger. Oh, I remember that household. That's the one who's got the dad that's out of town for the first two seasons or whatever. Right. I never talked much to Leo. Guess I'll just go fishing again. It's just so hard to ever meet Leo. Lily pads are absolutely horrendous to touch. If you've ever touched a lily pad, they, they're so incredibly slimy and off-putting, they definitely can't hold an entire person's weight on them. They look nice, though. They're quite a marvel of, you know, Design? Or evolution, or whatever. They're really interesting. They just grow up from the... from the bottom of... of the... whatever body of water they're in. And they just fan out at the top. They look... Interesting? They look like something, that's for sure. Oh. Keeping up conversation and catching fish is... Or timing fish is... More difficult than I would have anticipated.
Wish I had an umbrella. I just feel kind of odd standing out in the rain fishing in a suit jacket. Or actually, I think it's just one of those novelty t-shirts that has a suit print on it, given that it's fairly short sleeve. It's definitely not a full... Oh, oh, a tricky fish. It's definitely not the full outfit, that's for sure. Oh, that looked like a full cast. supposed to be that difficult yet. Make it easier to catch. Stop trying to live so much. Oh my goodness. Just thinking is difficult. I'm actually quite amazed that I've managed to, uh, stay streaming for as long as I have. I'm such a silent person when I just play games by myself. Oh. Some sort of frog sound? Oh my... I just remembered that there's a, a wizard off on the other side of this clearing and that magic exists in this game, and that I am absolutely horrendous at this timing, apparently. I swear I'm not this bad when I'm, you know, not streaming. Maybe I should just go entirely off of sound cues. Oh, hey, it's Leah. Let me just pause time really quickly while I catch this fish. to tick off all of the NPC boxes. No, no, stay right there. I need to record this absolute sham of a shad. I was trying to think of something to say, but that was not the correct one. Because it was a good shad. No shams there. I also just remembered that there's, like, special biting spots that you can fish at that increase your, uh, yield, or the speed at which fish bite. I don't remember which one affected it specifically. It always struck me as an odd system, because, you know, in order to find one of those spots, you have to, you know, not be fishing. So if you catch the fish faster by doing that, then you might as well have just stayed in one spot fishing. And this pops up on your screen and you don't have to go looking for it. Now this is probably the reason that I never got too far when I was... Or wasn't terribly efficient my first time playing this game. Because I would just sit in one spot fishing instead of improving my farm in any manageable way. Did what I say even make sense? Improve it? No. I said manageable. It's definitely not the word that I meant. Tangible. That's it. I said manageable instead of tangible. They sound roughly similar. I think that can be excused. Oh, you know what? 
I don't have a path in my farmland, so I can't take the path up north. I'm gonna have to go through the village. Definitely waiting too long to, uh, reel in for the hit. I keep waiting until the end of the, uh, alert. I need to imbue the power of lightning into my fingers. Oh no, I've run out of space. Well, I mean, most of my inventory is taken up by literal trash, so... It won't be hard to find room. Oh, I need to be more careful around that. I've, uh, I've still been playing, um, what is it, Slay the Spire in my spare time. Uh, I've beaten it with, what is it, the first three? I don't remember their names. Um, but most of those have probably just been out of pure luck. I... I don't have it in me to ever refuse a new card. Oh, okay. I'm the sort of person in uh, TCGs that uh, just plays decks that they think are interesting, not ones that are actually good. That's why my favorite form of uh, Magic the Gathering is... Uh, I forget what the proper name is, but, uh, the commander setup. Oh. It's got a proper name, I just don't remember what it is. E... E-R-M? E-D-T? E-D-M? E-S-T? I'm pretty sure it begins with an E. It's three letters. No, it's gone. Oh. I wish there were, um... I just wish I could play Magic on stream, that would be nice. There's, I mean, I know there are a couple of Magic TCG video games, but... doesn't really appeal to me that much, because I already have my collection of physical cards, and I don't want to pay to get digital cards, or open digital packs. Okay, okay. Because uh, I already have decks and cards that I like and... I've got some decently rare and good stuff as well. Um, my main deck is a, um, what is it, Moldrotha, I believe her name is? I haven't played Magic in quite a while. I have a really good Moldrotha deck, if that's her name. Is it one blue, one green, one black, three any color? Our text reads that uh, you can play. Oh, let me sell everything first. Uh, once per turn, you can play one of any or one of each uh, permanent type cards in your graveyard. Uh, so it's about just extreme graveyard setup and bunch of cards that tend to sacrifice themselves in order to get beneficial results, that sort of thing. It's a lot of fun to play. Because it can last a very long time. 
the, uh, the obvious, like, detriment at first glance is that you can't play, uh, sorceries or spells out of your graveyard using Muldrifa. But I have an enchantment that can recall sorceries and, uh, instants from the graveyard. Uh, and it sacrifices itself after the fact for a little bonus effect, so that even works in its favor as well. Alright. You know what, I'm gonna save up and buy a, um... Was it a fruit tree? It's only gonna take, what, two more days of fishing to do that? Probably be worth it, honestly. Um, but I should definitely clear out space for that. Off to the right here. I really should have just grabbed all of my tools, shouldn't I? I don't think the hoe is actually going to be useful, but... Maybe I'll run into some worms along the way. Oh, I can just hold down left quick. I've been spamming it whenever I tried to chop things down. Mm -hmm. I always make sure to uh, cut trees down so that they fall into more cleared areas. It just makes it easier to collect the wood. Because trees will always fall away from you. Important to remember. new or interesting recently? No. No, no, life's just been the same, really. Don't do much exciting. I've been thinking about D&D again recently. I actually used to do, um, DMing in D&D. I'm not a good DM, unfortunately. Alright, geodes exist. The one thing that I am good at in D&D is running combat encounters. Like I'm, I'm definitely no, like, prime NPC controller or story weaver. I'm pretty good at creating settings and then running combat encounters within those settings. As soon as I get into a heavily populated town and I need to play multiple NPCs at once, I just sort of freeze up and I am unable to run anything. Which is why my, uh... Oh. Okay. Hmm. Back when I ran a campaign, uh, I created a sort of fantasy poke post-apocalyptic world uh, in a vein somewhat similar to Dark Souls. Yeah. The game that I enjoy above almost all others. And spent several hours playing. Oh, that's something that I also meant to talk about. Um, when I tried to export that video off of, off of Twitch, uh, it didn't work properly. So, uh, that, the, 
the birthday endurance stream is unfortunately lost to time. Uh, or at least the first 12 hours are. Um, because what actually, like, properly happened was Twitch tried to do the export properly. However, uh, apparently YouTube won't let me upload videos in excess of 12 hours. So what it tried to do was cut up the live stream so that it was... Oh, why do I still have my axe? It's the hoe that I need to be carrying around. Um, but yes, uh, as I was saying, it tried to cut it up properly so that it would be 12 hours and what I think another... Three or four hours in addition to that? Not the... Am I just daft? Bring the hoe. Um, yeah, so the first 12 hours of the stream didn't properly get cut into 12 hours. It must have been, like, 12 hours in one minute. Because when I tried to, um, you know, when I went into my YouTube manager and... Or management. I don't have a manager on YouTube, but the, the YouTube manager where you manage your videos. Oh. Dengel, hello. I hope you're well. Um, ba -ba -ba. But as I was saying, uh, first 12 hours just gone. Unfortunate, but... Yeah. Nothing I'm too terribly heartbroken over. I guess I'm just here to sell you some wildly overpriced dandelions. I definitely don't have any quartz. I'm on day, what, four? You expect me to have quartz by now? I understand those quests are auto-generated, but it seems irresponsible to give you such a high-level quest this early on. Got some bones for you, friend. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Why don't I just sell it to you? I got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any artifacts or minerals that you find? We could make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items and send them their way. Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. Can do. Fossils can go up top, I suppose. I think that's a fossil. It looks like a bone. Probably should have read what it is. Can I look at the description? Okay. I think I actually have to walk over to it to see what the description is. But it looks like a, a pelvic bone, right? Vertebra. Okay. That's close. Vertebra bone connects to the pelvis bone. The pelvis bone connects to the hip bone. Wait, the pelvis bone is the hip bone. What's this, Majord, friend? Oh. Yay, some clay. Right. Oh. So if I go and just buy some food, then I can go fishing, right? 
because food restores energy, right? It's definitely no worry on their part. I never really expect anyone to come to my streams, in all honesty. It's just nice when people do. Right, I should keep the hoe with me. Take the bamboo rod. Do I need anything else? No, I'm all set. No birds better eat my crops. I wish they made the bottom screen in this area just a little bit lower. Because it... I just like the hotbar to be at the bottom. But it moves to the top on that screen because you're too low on the screen for it to maintain its position. Where do I buy food from? Can I just get some at the convenience store? You sell food, Pierre? Oh! Oh no, please don't! Oh no. Are you closed? Or are you just taking a break? What does what does your schedule say? Give, it, give me the times, please. I thought you were open until nine. You can't do this to me. I'm hungry and I need to fish. I suppose I can just eat the fish, but I don't think they give me that much energy. I got food here? Is it- isn't it- I thought it was still too early for this, okay. Uh... I mean, bread's... probably gonna give me the most energy. Yeah, let's just get some bread. It's cheap, and it'll let me fish. Where to fish, though? Let's just go to the ocean. Oh, that's not as much energy as I thought it would be. Oh, I thought I only had 200 maximum energy. Mildly mistaken. Oh well. Can I just fish here? I don't want to go all the way down to the ocean. This is as good a place as any. <laughs> uh, I don't even have time to move my microphone. Ah! Well, at least I didn't even get trash that time. Oh, I bit my tongue. Ow. Not hard, it was just on the side. more annoying feeling than painful. Oh. What? I'm fishing. Did you just keep the music on? Is there... Is the, is the music actually diegetic and since we're past seven o'clock? I just got noise complaints from the local villagers. Kids playing their music too loud. Well, I, I am right below the, uh, is it the oldest couple in the village? Right. Old people live here, right? This house is fancy. Yeah. Alright, you're the, you're the mayor. Uh, I was mistaken about which old people I was under. I was thinking it was... was it these... There's old people here, right? I think I was thinking about the, the trailer. There's old people somewhere... Well, this town is mostly old people. I'll just walk to a different venue. Do some fishing up north. Uh, 
don't know if there's like a, a prime fishing spot that has the highest value fish or whatever. All right, the homeless man up there. All right, the boulder. I've I've entirely forgotten that there's an entire caving mini game. All right, the emo guy. I'm remembering so many things. I actually used to spend quite a lot of time at this specific spot fishing back in the good old days. When, when did this game come out? I don't really have time to look it up. That would have been when I played it last. Oh, that's a big bird. I got distracted by the bird and missed my fish. Must have been his plot all along. Keep the fish for himself, that bird. I suppose it's my plot to keep talking so that I can't Focus on fishing. Because I'm incompetent. See, does the energy get used when you cast the line or when you reel it back in? Or both? I'll do a little bit of testing just to make sure. They just keep giving me such convenient treasure chests. The fate that I can't yet use. 57 right now. Oh. That's when you throw out the line. Did not expect it to take that much energy, though. No. Okay. Yeah. Oh. I don't know. I need to I need to reel in one more fish in order to be absolutely certain that it doesn't drain stamina when reeling in. Okay, it looks like it it doesn't entirely certain yet. Okay. It's only when casting. When do I have to be in bed by two? I think it's two o'clock when I when I just collapse. Oh. Yeah, I think it's two. I've got time for one more fish. Sure is fortunate that time conveniently freezes while fishing. Uh, I've got ooh a gold. That's pretty nice. I can get one more. Just one more. Alright. If it hits 1240 before I reel in this fish. Okay, there we go. Because I also need to get home in time. Alright, gotta run. It's so dark. Well, I guess it is past midnight. Oh, well, maybe I overestimated the speed at which I could make it home. I do have the shortcut up here. Oh, but I need to sell everything. Oh, I've got time. I can do it. I just need to cut every single corner I possibly can. Ah, uh, whoops. Didn't mean to sell the bait. That's fine. Scarecrow already. I'm so 
absolutely paranoid about ravens. There we go. I knew it was going to happen. Oh, hey, I grew parsnips. Uh, that means I should probably go about um, redoing everything. Oh, deluxe fishing pole. Wow. What was I saving up for? Right, fruit tree. I'll get that deluxe fishing pole a bit later. Oh, curse. Pox upon your family. Oh, I can't even see the lure. Wonderful. I'll just have to operate by sound. I wonder if it would be easier for me to close my eyes during the uh, casting portion of fishing and just operate 100% off of sound. I feel like I'd probably do pretty well. Anyway, let's, let's test this experiment. I'm gonna keep my eyes closed. I mean, that's a, that's a test result of one, so not entirely conclusive. But it seems like a, it seems like my hypothesis may hold true. Or maybe if I just don't look at the screen, I can just stare at chat. Oh, no, never mind. But talking also doesn't help. Because I want to finish what I'm saying before I do anything else. And by doing anything else, that includes clicking the mouse button to reel in the fish. Mm -hmm. Don't make noises that sound like the reel. That's not fair. You're cheating, game. Oh, not another feisty fish. I don't have a good enough fishing rod for you yet. That was actually an accident. I just wanted to pull my rod back in so that I could go to the shop. It's nine o'clock now. I think I already tired it out. It, oh, never mind. It's still energetic. All right. I know when I've lost. Oh, no. Oh, no, those are 2,000 apiece. Oh, well, uh, 2,000 and up. Yeah. Apricot. It's the only one I could buy for 2,000. Maybe I'm shooting a bit too high a bit too early. I'll, uh... I'll hold off on that one. What annoying. I'm just so close. I'm one big purchase off. Let me just go... down to curmudgeon the fisherman and see how much the new fishing rod's gonna be. Because if it's, you know, around 1k, then I'll probably just buy the fishing rod. It'll be more fun to just have a good fishing rod than a tree that sits there doing nothing. Fiberglass? Uh, mm, it's within my ability to purchase, so... Why not? Can I sell you the old one, please? I don't need it anymore. Does this have? It has a spot for a lure, but no bait. I forgot what new fishing rods do. 
Do they just make it bigger? The area in which you can catch fish? I think it does. Again, it's been an exceptionally long time. Chat! Oh no! It looks almost no larger. Does the line go up faster? Oh! Okay. Thanks for the loud achievement. I kind of wish I was doing something a bit more interesting than, you know, playing the game as intended. I'm not good enough at this to do any challenge runs or... special interesting things. I always find it's never very interest. well, to me, at the very least. I'm never very interested in watching people play games that they've already played before. I feel like that's a... a somewhat general statement. Obviously not shared by everyone, or else people replaying games wouldn't be, you know, a watched category on Twitch. It's just something that I tend not to be too terribly interested in. The, the reason I watch streaming content is to witness people having new or novel experiences. Alright, so I can't put the bait on, right? Okay. I don't know if that's how you do it, but it doesn't seem like it. And this is just me playing a, a fishing mini game. How long have I been going? An hour and a half. Wow. And I've made so little progress. And I guess I got a new fishing rod. So that's nice. Am I supposed to go to the, uh, the lady who speaks to you in the tutorial in order to learn how to make a scarecrow? Because I'm still paranoid about that. Oh, you know what? I should... I should probably buy seeds. Oh. Hello, emo friend. What's his name? Simon? It begins with an S, right? Sebastian. That's it. You have the same name as my cat. Wrong color, but, you know. Same name. It's, uh, it's actually pretty satisfying, um, landing the, what is it, the bar, I suppose, in the fishing minigame, straight on the bottom without having it bounce at all. It'd be kind of hard to, uh, illustrate it while it's happening. But if you, like, pull the bar up high on the meter itself, uh, and then drop it quickly, It'll bounce off of the ground like that. But if you just sort of pull up in the nick of time, you can either completely eliminate or greatly reduce the amount of bounce you get. This is just a lot of fun to do, in my opinion. 
Not everyone will understand the joys of reducing bounce to its maximum amount. It's just the efficiency beast within me crying out in pleasure. Ah, uh, not a good... Not a very good rest there. Could have done a better job. Oh, mm -mm. That's fine. Let me, let me just go sell these fish and head over to Pierre because apparently he closes at five. Who would have guessed? I definitely, uh, definitely need that, uh, ba -ba -ba seeds, so that I don't have an empty patch just wasting space. Well, apparently that's a dead end. Can you just cut one of those bushes down? I know it's a graveyard. Respect and whatever, but I'd really like to just be able to walk through that area. Right. Let's just buy a whole mess of parsnip seeds. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. I like to buy things in multiples of nine. It just works. All of this just works. Hmm. Hmm. Thanks for the ad beer. I already know about your wonderful backpack. Thank you, Joja Mark. I've never once patronized your store, and I doubt I ever will. I don't know how not to plant crops like this. Where are you guys to being fully grown bean stalks? Alright, I've got what, two good fishes left in me? that the uh, ground you're walking on impacts your walking sounds. It's not much of an observation at all. And uh, it's a pretty standard feature. But also, what is there even to talk about while playing this game? Oh no, Sebastian, please, I'm fishing here. You can't. Please just attempt to phase through me as hard as possible. There we go. Yeah, I know. Oh, I can get one more fish out of this. Because a single cast takes eight energy. Uh, but if I even swing another thing, I will collapse. gonna move off of any tool that could consume stamina. Wow. Wait. Oh, I had one more cast, but I just... I very specifically pointed that out, but I did not take any advantage of it whatsoever. Hmm. Probably for the best. Really neat that I got two gold star fish immediately out of that. Um, oh yeah, bamboo 
rod that can go away forever and never come back. I like the ambiance. Can I? There we go. <gasps> there it is! Scarecrow! I think I, since the, the newspaper was the first item that I put in the, uh... Oh, it's still raining. Wait. Was it the newspaper was the first item I put in there? It used that to represent my rather impressive fishing hole for the day. Crafting the scarecrow. Wood, coal, fiber. I think I've got enough of each. You can just live, what, here? That should cover my entire field. Whew. Safe at last. Uh, okay, Hat Mouse. I don't remember you being in the original version of the game. Oh. Oh. Such a lovely lady, that Robin. Making fun of all of my earthly belongings. Can I just go fishing all day? No, yeah, why not? I just really need to make that dough. To rest my shoulder. Any shoulder exercises? Because apparently, streaming just absolutely destroys my shoulders. Are push ups shoulder exercises? Does that count? Does that work out your shoulder muscles? Or is it just more general arm and bicep area? I know next to nothing about exercise. And just fortunately live a fairly active lifestyle. I don't need to focus too much on maintaining weight. And my metabolism is blissfully high, so. Who knows how long that'll last. Who wants to talk about inevitable mortality in our decaying bodies? What a lovely topic. Oh, not another feisty fish. I don't have a high enough quality fishing rod for you. Oh, maybe I... Okay, maybe I have a high enough quality fishing rod, but not a high enough quality fingers. I was doing all right. A worthier man would have been able to catch that fish. Oh. Uh, and my reward for all my effort? Was a single green algae. Oh. Mm. Alright. That was the first treasure chest with an issue. No. Come on. You're an easy fish. Don't make me lose my treasure over you. Ah, two whole wood. What a score. I was expecting at least a geode out of that. Ah, oh, not another one of you. Ah, 
It's only 9.30 a.m. in game. Oh, hey. An entire soda. I just threw a fully full and sealed can into the river. I just thought of something, but I don't actually know if I did. I made an exclamation as if I had thought of something. But uh, as soon as I tried to focus on whatever I thought I thought, it just flew from my head. Alright, that's, that's too much soda. One can, maybe. Two? That's excessive. Unless... The Joga Cola is just full of river water. Oh, big shad. Gold star. I don't think the gold stars are actually worth that much. It's a bit deceptive. Should probably be saving all of the gold stars for the uh, town hall. But also, I'm not. I'm definitely not playing through that long. This was just gonna be a, a short stream for a day, just to fill some time. Because I, I need to be streaming. Whenever I fall out of the habit of things, I fall out of habits hard. I only streamed once last week. I can feel the lethargy setting in. I'm not even gonna comment on that third cola can. I wonder if a uh, transport truck just sort of crashed nearby the river. That's why I'm pulling out so many fully sealed cans of cola. I don't think I've drank soda in at least half a year at this point. Not something that I really do too much. Caffeinated beverages in general don't really appeal to me. Oh no. It would probably help me out in in my daily life. Just, uh, it's just too much effort for me. You know, to feel alive. I'm just as content suffering through my day with no energy. If I just want to hear the full jingle before I pull in on the fish, like subconsciously, I myself obviously don't care too much about the jingle. It just seems like I'm incapable of pressing the button early. Side quest do I have right now? That exclamation part points. Just keeps wildly jiggling, which means oh. I guess I have things that I can claim money for. 
Thanks for teleporting money directly to me, everyone. <sighs> How much were cherry trees? 3,000? I'd rather get a cherry tree than an apricot tree. Even though I don't really know if cherries and apricots are going to be priced any differently. I just prefer cherries to apricots. And I know in real life cherries are very expensive. But I don't know about in game. My eyelids are actually growing heavy. It's a bit early for me, too. Mm. No, I just miss the improved endgame rods. All I, all I really remember is having a bar that fills up like half of the, the meter. Obviously not to that extreme. I don't actually remember exactly how much it covered, but it was a decent amount. Oh, not another fast fish. I recently, um... Alex Mukla, the uh, YouTuber who does a lot of uh, analysis of music from games and anime. I recently watched his video on music from Nier, and I've had, I think it's Kainé's theme stuck in my head. That one. Pretty sure it's Kaine. Yeah, no, that's Kaine's theme. Never actually played uh, near Replicant or Gestalt. Uh, only Automata. But I watched a full playthrough of Replicant, and I think just Replicant, technically, actually, but. I don't think it would be too interesting watching someone play a game who knows how it ends. Especially a Yoko Taro game. Those hinge on the reaction to discoveries of major plot beats. Plus I don't own replicants or... What is... It's Reincarnation is the re-released version, I believe. I don't own it. And right now I don't really have the disposable income to buy it either, so... Right. I'm gonna stop complaining about this fish being f oh. I was gonna say, I'm gonna stop complaining about it being fast and actually try and catch it, but... It was not in the books, apparently. Glasses be gone. I need to replace you with a three star fish or a gold star fish. It's technically only a single star. Oh, oh, wow. An iridium star chub. That's special. All right. And I can throw away the consolation prize wood that I don't really need. Mm -hmm. 
Probably wrap up stream soon by the end of end of the day in game. Now here's here's a topic. I don't like. Uh, I'm trying to think how to broach the topic. When I have less than like four viewers, I don't like rating. Like, even personal friends. Or I know won't be bothered by it. it. It just feels sort of like I'm walking up to a streamer and being like, "Hey, I was I was streaming. Pay attention to me. I am important, and I'm not contributing anything to them really. I'm just making a commotion and drawing attention myself, which I don't really want to be doing." Feels kind of rude. Because at least when you're bringing a decent sized number of people. Oh wow, that's a whole bunch of stuff. Rice? This isn't even rice season, is it? Yeah, well. Algae and cola can go. Yeah. I just have an issue with it. I don't like drawing attention away from the stream just to, just to be like, hey, I brought a single viewer that may or may not be a bot into your chat. Please greet me and pay attention to me. It's, it just feels rude. So, uh, long story short, that's my justification for why I'm probably not going to raid after this stream because it would make me too embarrassed. Oh no. Ah! I pressed a button too many times. What is it? E? No. F? What button was I pressing? R? Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. That means I'm gonna wake up tomorrow with half stamina. <sighs> it's fine. I made two thousand or one thousand two hundred dollars fishing though. Or gold, actually. For some reason this town subsists on gold instead of <laughs> Legal tender. Alright. Well. Oh, that's good. That was a good two hour stream. That hour 50. Counts a bit off on the actual stream since it crashed once. Oh, my BGM's been playing this entire time. That's fine. It makes those moments of. Silence, a bit less silent. I suppose that probably means that, uh... uh nobody... Nobody alerted me to the fact that my BGM was still playing. So, I guess it wasn't that distracting. But thank you to the people who showed up and said hello, and people who showed up and didn't say hello, that's perfectly valid as well. Uh, I'm tired. And I hope you enjoyed yourself. Au revoir.